I'm Caroline Cham and I went to Bridgeton College Randwick. Uh, I designed a light rail system going from La Perouse to the city. It should take about 20 minutes from La Perouse to the city. At the station, there's ramps going down. Um, so what would happen is that a, the connecting cabin from the light rail system would go down at a, st a station and the passengers would go off while another carriage would be going up at the same time and it would be picked up by the main carriage. It's elevated so that it doesn't um, interfere with other traffic on the road. It doesn't have the delays that other public transport does like buses where they have to stop and pick up and drop off passengers. It doesn't have to go through the traffic lights and traffic which makes it more reliable and it stops on time at each station. I catch a bus every day so I, I realise how slow it is and how it can be unreliable, it doesn't stop on, on time. And also sometimes the buses are too full to pick up more passengers at other stations, other stops. I had to make a few sketches and then I had to make prototypes and like work out how it works. Using, I used um, some wooden blocks at school to try and figure out how to work, make it work. I use Google SketchUp to do my animation. When the light rail arrives, it will not stop at all. It just slows down to pick up the pickup carriage, which will ascend the ramp and move with the light rail. I got these articles from Southern Korea, which is the local paper, and it shows how um, a lot of people want it, which means that there's a need for it. The fact that it's in the news and it's talk the governments have been talking about building it contributes to how it's a genuine need of how a light rail system is needed, especially in the southeast suburbs of Sydney. It's more environmentally friendly because it doesn't stop as much, so it saves energy from having to like, create more energy to speed up and slow down and stop. And also um, I have solar panels on top of the light rail system so that that can power the lights and the air conditioning at, inside, the, inside the carriages, as well as having solar panels at each station to power the lighting. And also it's made out of stainless steel, which is a very lightweight and recyclable material. Uh, yeah, I've been thinking about talking to Ramit Council about it. I haven't got to do it yet.